Hi, I'm back, your teacher Hazel in Art 7. For today's discussion, quarter 3, week 7, day 7, with our objective, show the relationship of development of crops in specific areas of the country according to functionality, traditional specialized expertise, and availability of resources. We start with the Bajal people, known as the Sea Gypsies of the Sulu and Celebi Seas. Unique to their cultural rituals is the concept of life and their relationship to the sea. They are scattered along the coastal areas of Tawi-Tawi, Sulu, Basilan, and some coastal municipalities of Sambuanga del Sur in the ARMM. Among themselves, they are known as the Samalaus and are found living on houseboats where they make their li livelihood solely on the sea as expert fishermen, deep sea divers, and navigators. They come to share to barter their harvest for farmed produce such as fruits and cassava as well as to replenish their supplies or make repairs to their houseboats. The Yakan. The Yakan people are among the major indigenous Filipino ethno-linguistic groups in the Sulu archipelago, also known as the Jim River, having a significant number of followers of Islam. It is considered as one of the 13 Moro groups in the Philippines. The Yakans mainly reside in Basilan but also in Sambuanga City. The Yakan people are recognized to their remarkable technicolor geometric weaves and distinctive face decoration used in their traditional ceremonies. The Yakan have designs or motifs used repeatedly in all their visual arts and crafts. The Pusuk Labung is so tooth design used for cloth baskets and the native sword called crease. The Bunga Sama used for table runners, monuments for the dead and on trunks, is a symmetrical design made of rectangular shaped figures. The Taosug, the Taosug or Suluk is the name of an Islamized tribal group in the Sulu archipelago and is taken from the words Tau meaning man and Sug meaning current. This homogeneous tribe is a blend of Malay and Indonesian races. They are widespread in the Philippines and can be found mainly in coastal area communities. Tausug visual arts are represented by carvings, metal works, wood and stone works, textile and fashion, pottery and basketry. The Subanin, Subanin people, also known as Subanan or Subano, derived from the word Suba, a Visayan word meaning river, as most of the settlements can be found near rivers or mountain streams. Subanan arts and crafts with the Subanan accessories are part of the traditional Subanan costumes. Similarly, they are also patterned and designed in the line of Subanan people's beliefs and practices. Subanan costume and fashion cloth weaving is basically similar to the style of the neighboring Muslim region. And that's all for today. Thank you for listening. Did you understand it well?
If not, you may go back to the lesson presented in your module. And if today's lesson is very clear to you, congratulations! You may now answer the exercises in your module. Once again, this is your teacher Hazel saying goodbye!